Hi everybody, my name is Janet Chow and in this video you will learn all about our course expectations and what we'll be learning in English class this year, so stay tuned. These are some of my favorite books to teach and I cannot wait to share them with my students. In addition to studying literature, students will produce a variety of writing pieces throughout the year, including narrative essay, argumentative essay, informative and explanatory essay, literary analysis, and, and a big research essay project. Our vocabulary program this year will be an etymology-based program using context-based root words that can be found in the classroom literature that we are reading. So the example below is what I used to introduce this program to the students earlier this week. A lot of them do not know what anti-disestablishmentarianism means, but when you break it down to its individual word parts, the prefixes, suffixes, and the roots, then the students were able to make a, uh, an educated guess on what that unfamiliar vocab word might mean. That is the whole point of this vocabulary program. Although I love technology and everything that it has to offer in the classroom, I really wanted to make an effort this year on being unplugged as much as possible with the students in our class. After a year of virtual learning and Google Meets and classroom, I just really thought it would be beneficial for our children to be uh, social with one another, to be able to write with a pencil on paper and hand something in physically and having that satisfaction of knowing that I completed this with my own two hands, I just thought was really important and I wanted to make sure we incorporated that this year. These are very similar course expectations as your other classes and all the details can be found in the course expectations paper that was sent home at the beginning of the year. Um, the most important thing for me is for students to, number one, they must read at home. There will be some at home reading this year and that's very, very important so that they are prepared to discuss and to share their ideas in class. Secondly is for students to be kind and to keep an open mind and be respectful of other people's opinions. Thank you so much for watching this back to school night video and I'm excited to see what this year will bring. If you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to email me at the email on I think this side of the screen. Um, have a great day.